If your Motorola phone is stuck in an endless boot loop while charging or randomly and it just keeps showing this Motorola logo then shuts off only to restart itself over and over again, don't worry. In this video, we will walk you through exactly what to do to fix this issue. So we are using the Motorola Edge 50 Fusion for this video but this process will work on any Moto series phone like EG, Razer or Stylus running on Android 15. Now first of all, if you're using any phone back or front cover, just go ahead and take it off. And then what you need to do is just clean this power button. Cause you know, a lot of times this button just gets jammed with dust or debris, sweat or even beverage. After cleaning, we're gonna go ahead and play a trick. Just quickly press and release this button quite a few times to make sure that it's not jammed. Because you know, a lot of times this is the main issue that it's stuck on this endless boot loop. Now, if that didn't solve your problem, now we're gonna just go ahead first, restart it. So just hold down this power key or the volume up and power key if you are using an older model or whatever works for you. Just keep holding it until the Hello Moto shows up on your screen. Now, in this situation, you might need to try out force restart a few times. If it's still not working, don't worry, you know, just go ahead, straight plug it in, put it on charge and we're gonna charge it for a few minutes, 5 to 10. After that, while it's still plugged in, force restart it. If it's still not turning on properly, now whatever on your screen, just press and hold this volume down and power button together till you end up in this, you know, upside down Android section. If you can see it on your screen as well, Use your volume key to recovery and then select the option with the power button. You will eventually end up in this no command section. When you do, just press and hold the power button and then press once on the volume up button. Now this will take you to the recovery mode instantly. From here, first you can just go ahead, try out reboot system now and see if that restores your phone properly. Otherwise, my friend, you need to come back in here and now we're gonna go for the wipe data or factory reset process. But please remember this will erase all the data from your phone. And secondly, if you're already using any screen lock or logged in with your Gmail account, you'll need any one of them to reset up your device once again. If you're okay with everything, you just want your phone back in a normal state, just go ahead, follow the prompts to wipe data and factory reset. After the hard reset is complete, you will end up in this section. Now just use the reboot system now option to restart your device properly. And if there is no hardware issue, my friend, your device will turn on normally without any problem. Just go ahead, follow the prompts and reset up your device. Hope we could help you in time of crisis. Thanks for watching.